Ghana has huge potential for rice production, which is evident in its favorable climatic conditions, availability of arable lands, and an open society with a vibrant democracy. The importation of rice into Ghana exceeds 60% annually with dire economic consequences. Between 2007 and 2015, the amount spent on imported rice rose from $151 million to $1.2 billion per annum, with domestic consumption supplemented by imports primarily from Thailand, Vietnam and India. Ghana's annual rice importation, which currently stands at 1.3 billion US dollars, continues to increase year after year. This negative narrative on the rice sector can only be changed with the injection of massive capital by big sector players from the private sector. There's been quite a, a, a rapid growth, and the growth is not enough to catch up with the demand, and, and that's the difference is being made up by imports. So there's a huge Potential for our foreign uh, investors, potential investors who are now here uh, to explore the possibilities. This collaboration should enable this country to come up to your level. The Minister for Trade and Industry, Alan Kojo Tremanting, says government will provide framework for the project. By focusing on these two products and some of the others, uh, we are not just talking about producing locally what we currently import, but we are also talking about how we can affect the lives of many people who are engaged in rice uh, farming. Here is the Honorary Consular of Ghana to Thailand, Dr. Sicha Singh Sombumis. The new relationships between Ghana and Thailand, I think, if we done this project successful, then the people of both countries will cultivate relationship more.